Well, here we are at the uh, Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Championship. You know, the championship that we've been a part of um, for 11 years now is always exciting. I think they recognize the value and understand the opportunity they've got to follow their passion while going to college and, and being able to do both. I think it's really important that Cabela's is involved in the Collegiate Bass Series. Just getting kids or getting the anglers out on the water, really supporting them in hunting, fishing, kind of setting up that lifestyle for them going forward. And we're really excited and really proud to be a part of this overall event. College angling, to me, has done an incredible job of creating a renewed interest in the fishing industry. It makes a big difference, to, uh, I think, to be able to televise this, show young guys catching fish, using new, uh, new equipment, I think college bass fishing is awesome for our industry in a couple of different ways. From my perspective and a manufacturer's perspective, like this is, a, this is the farm system of, of getting guys grown into the sport and, and becoming familiar with your product and it's just a great opportunity to create those relationships with future customers. And we're fortunate enough at, at Ranger to partner with the Yamaha and offer demo rides so it's, a, uh, it's an awesome uh, opportunity to, to expose guys to our product, especially guys that are about to be um, you know, in the job market with disposable income, they're passionate about the sport. Um, so it's a, it's, a, it's a great thing for us and, and we enjoy that demo ride night and getting to meet anglers and spend time on the water. Obviously they they've see the value in it to get to these kids early, you know, get them involved and making sure they show them that you're caring about them so they don't, you know, go down a different path and they stay in the sport. I think, you know, it's the younger generation coming up and in the fishing industry and reaching these guys is so important to us, especially as an electronics company, because we're trying to grow our business. It's it's cool to see them, you know, soaking it all in and, you know, seeing what they could use to better themselves as an angler and just everything. It looks, it's, it's a great event and I'm so happy Garmin's a part of it. It's exciting. There's 175 teams here from I don't know how many schools are represented and all, but it's pretty exciting and these kids are really excited about it. They are the future of fishing and they're, you know, the, the future of our industry and, uh, you know, we got to support them and, and keep them loyal for, uh, you know, at a young age. These are the people that are going to be growing into the sport and bringing other people into the sport. Um, these are the people that spend money to buy the products in the fishing industry. Um, and are going to continue so. Anytime that you can build relationships in anything, that's what makes a successful business, a successful tournament series, um, a successful anything really. You know, we've been coming every year as a sponsor and uh, I just think it's a great way to get young people together to have a good time and, and, and as well be able to compete. Everyone who comes by is very thankful, very kind and considerate. And I think that fishing is such a humbling sport, especially at this tournament specifically, because of all of the boosts and all of the support that you guys give the college fishermen. So I want to thank you all for that. They're just all around good guys. I mean, extremely polite, uh, professional in, in all aspects um, of the sport and in the way that they uh, present themselves. We think it's super awesome. Like, there's so many people here. We would never expect there to be that many people. We're super impressed with Cabela's for putting this on. Well, this is my last tournament. It's been a great four seasons. These people really take care of you. They take care of you with gear, free things. They feed you. Um, you know, we don't always get that. And you know, I spoke. I speak very highly of this organization. 